What are my best options for treating vaginal dryness as I'm in perimenopause or experiencing uh, maybe postpartum, um, maybe if I'm on birth control or in menopause? So 85% of women in menopause experience vaginal dryness. It's inevitable. There's no cure. It's a natural transition that every woman is gonna go through in their life. So what can we do to help? The first thing I can recommend is estrogen therapy um, or a topical estrogen that you can, or a vaginal estrogen. Um, those are things you can consult with a menopause specialist. Estrogen begins to decline and that's the number one reason you're experiencing dryness in your vagina, you're experiencing dryness on your skin, your hair, everything's drying out as we're um, approaching and in menopause. Another way you can supplement these estrogens is with something called phytoestrogens, which are from uh, plants. And these phytoestrogens um, can come in supplements or you can find them in some of the foods you eat. So soy, for instance, would have soy ifoflavones, which is um, a, a natural phytoestrogen. And, um, or you can pick up a supplement of, of that. And lastly, I'd recommend May by Deneva to help with moisturizing and lubrication. The thing about May, how it's different than other moisturizers and lubes, is it's all natural. It's chemical free, it's made from plant butters, and it has the right pH for the vaginal environment. And that is so important so you can stave off any infections, if you're prone to yeast infections or bacterial vaginosis or other things, May is the product that keeps your pH in balance. So if you find this uh, video interesting, um, please share it with your friends, please like, and please subscribe to our channel.